let's look at some of your pictures again because they're so fun. So your lats actually start on the front of your shoulder and they run through your armpit and then they come through your armpit and make this muscle right here that kind of reminds me of Batman. That's kind of how I used to keep it straight in my head which one it was. So your lats are this wing shaped one on the back and you can kind of see it on somebody. Sometimes you'll see like this line down your back. That's your lats, okay? And they attach down here into this white structure. That's the thoraco, um, lumbar fascia and as your lats pull the fascia this direction your glutes pull the fascia this direction and it creates this connection diagonally across your back where your lats and your glutes but the thoracolumbar fascia is important because you can see how the um, vertebrae of the spine are nestled in that thoracolumbar fascia and that as we create tension from the lats pulling one direction and the glutes pulling the other direction it helps to give more stability to your spine and it helps to make your movement more efficient but um, when your lats are tight they can pull your armpit more back into that arch that you see when this is tilting forward. And um, so this is not, if you're somebody who's stuck in an anterior pelvic tilt, I would not start with your lats. I would start with addressing your hip flexor mobility and your ab strength. And if you want to see more on those topics, let me know. Um, but then if that doesn't seem to address your pelvic position, taking a look at your lats might be the answer. Let's look at, but, but 